Hi right, guys, welcome to episode 19 of Salvi City, class of 2019 on FIFA 20. Today we got brothers at home, then we got Exeter away. We just got another four, a loan number four Lins for a one year deal from WS Wonderers, which I will reject. Welcome back. We're playing Bradford now. Being the leading marksman in the league, he's the man everyone is talking about as he warms up. Can he score again today? We're about to find out. Welcome to more land as a host in Bradford. I'm Derek Ray. With me for commentary is Lee Dixon. And our live coverage comes to you from League Two. So many storylines, Lee. Thanks, Derek. Good atmosphere here. Everybody looking forward to what should be a really entertaining game. This is the lineup for the home team. This is a formation most people in the game are very familiar with nowadays. This is our A team. Adopting this formation, what it does give you is two holding players in front of the back four to protect them, but it also gives you three supporting players to that central striker. And this is Bradford's team. O'Donnell, Kipton, Richard, Everton, Ocon, Henley, Ismail, Akbam, Palmer, Wood, Kassam and Ford. James Ford, the former Everton player. Miles will play a 4-4-2 formation. And Akbam is a, a, yellow, a yellow card away from a, a suspension. But it's a stubborn lock on it. Place it through to the blue or nine. The blue or nine. What now the fifth minute? And it's with foot twos. Who set up that goal in so it's covered up on the new R9 to finish it off. Well when the run is time to perfection and the ball is perfectly weighted. The new R9 has bit their defence centre backs to the part. Again, from a different angle. And now it's got for 16th in the league. Here comes Cook. Plays it out wide. Here comes Pereira. Of course it's in! What a good save that is! And here comes Capo, plays it to Suscovalo. Tries to find the ball, and he does! And it's Capo! Capo shoots! And he scores the second of the game in the 20th minute to make it 2 0 in this game. And there were fun twos on it again. They are only like a car bonnet. Well, you could be critical of the defending, but let's focus on the great play. Capped off with a superb, calm, calculated finish. Slightly different vantage point in terms of the goal that was scored. Uh, at this point, we are going to win the lead by, by, by Cantor. Well, no wonder he's delighted. They've been bossing this game up to now. And this capital 17th in the league. Pereira. 
Super Hour. Cross is in. Chips it. And what a poor head from Sumanua on that. He could have scored his hat trick. But he did it way over. Gomez. How wide to focus. In floor 2. But he's off and it's 2 0 for the class of 2019. Still Capo. Who could tackle? And it's full time. They finish tip 2. They finish 2 0 here. We will do all nine scoring both goals. Right, see for both my interview. Hi, uh, just a couple of questions for you. With two goals to this, two seconds with Kemper was here. Do they have any thoughts? An overall great performance. The tag team deserve for a good. It's clear that Kappa stood out of the book as a cover always put a group up before the individual. Salvage is and beating the AFL D2 to so all you covered up to keep the short streak rolling. We have all the takes. We the least we can get out of the network is a draw, so we have all the takes to keep the streak going. Coming into this very much between your side, Bradford City and Bradford City. Do you have any thoughts about uh, we class of 2019 always win. I always expect it. We will reason in crisis by our much. Thank you so much for your time. We just got another four Richie Tower for 630,000 from Pachuca, which I can accept. Welcome back to the last game of the episode. I just fired one of a few scouts. It wasn't good enough. I can't afford much more. Let's see. We can't afford that. We can afford him. I'll be boy, I'm just gonna wait till a new season now. Right, I see him in the match. Hi everyone, it is an absolutely splendid... Welcome to St James's Park, not the Newcastle from the stadium, but the Exeter City Stadium, where they are hosting Salvador City. Thanks Derek, good atmosphere here. Everybody looking forward to what should be a really entertaining game. <laughs> Well, there's no getting away from it. This is the man. So He's retiring soon. Woodman retiring soon. And he's a defender for Exeter City. And what a loss for the club that is bound to be Lee. Well, legend is a very overused word in my book in football, but this guy deserves that label. He'll be sadly missed next season for sure. How do they make up for him not being there? Looks like the transfer window for me. And the lineup. And his team. Max Dead is Moxie, Parks, Woodman, Spot, Atangana, Dudu, Randall, Sparks, Ford, and Fisher. I'm a player 4 4 2 for Major. And Moxie is with Captain for their team. Most coaches are adopting this formation. What it does give you is two holding players in front of the back four to protect them, but it also gives you three supporting players to that central striker. Four to Fisher. Morganson. Falkaff. Cook. So it's got a lot. And so it's got a scored in the first five minutes to make it 1 0. This is, this is the start what 
This guy just put a 90 was wanted. And a good piece of play from Silver City. Move on foot on that. One hand on that. EFL League 2 trophy. To the Scover Law. Blaze it downfield to the new on eye. The new on eye. And it's 2 0 with the first 16 minutes. And it's our foot to cause an effort yet again in these games. And that was a cool, cool piece of play from Marcus Town. And the goal again, albeit from a different angle. Well, there's nothing better for a manager when a plan comes together. Total satisfaction. And this goes 18 for the league. Blends off left, he's got blends of space down his left. Who crosses it? That's it! And Sir Henry headed it over. He should have done better that shot. Parks. Woodman. There's been a goal in one of the other matches, Alan McAnally. It's a goal for Walker. Falker! And it's Bogov just shot it just over the right back. There's it down, Will. Pro! Cross it in! And more, Captain Morgan he shot it right over. It's a really difficult technique, but it's worth a go. He had a go and he failed. But it was an eye right and that was all handsome. Marlo. Cup boys for half time, it's 2 0. And it's the top, the top two scoring this team. You scored it for the class of 2019. And it's a little slow day and Morris for four, four eight minutes. Two screen it. Paul Jackson got it. There's a four forward. Finds Cup. And it's four time finished two nil. And it's the top two scorers who scored it. In this in this class of 2019. So I've got this one so far in my head, are you confident to keep the streak rolling? We have what it takes. The least we can get out of an exit at all, so we have what it takes to keep the streak going. Coming to this, where was there much between your side and Exeter City? Do you have any doubts you come away with a ring? We're class of 29 always win. I always expect it. the only reason we're great is by how much. You won the game, do you think Exeter play well? Not as well as us. We respect them and they play well, but clearly it's obviously plays were played better. Thanks, that'll be all for today. Hi right, guys, thanks again for watching episode 19. Don't forget to like, comment below, subscribe, turn the notification bell on to turn to see, catch all the videos on this on this site, on this channel. I mean, when I run you to 
upload this on all your social, social media and watch my playlist from episode one. I want you to stay home, social, social distance, and stay safe of this pandemic. Right, this is MJ Gaming Place. Guess what? I'm out of here.